Yummy. We are on the table at the Yucky Mart with wave two of the grocery gang your shoppin's gone rotten versus the clean team putrid power action figures. Three new action figures to look at today, as well as this trash can full of 16 groceries inside. So let's open up and see what wave two delivers. Let's start off with the famous powered up squished banana, Ricardo. Whoops, scared the pup away. Looks like the Wave 2 action figures are pretty much in the same packaging as the Wave 1. On the back of the card we have a bio. Squished Banana, aka Ricardo. Squished Banana is the most unappealing dude you'll meet. Some days he's a romantic fool, some days he's a rotten fruit. You never know because of his split personality. This guy can't wait to get his smiley slippery hands on the clean team and put on a few bends into them so he can impress the grocery of his dreams. Get ready to fight dirty. Love the bios. And of course, other figures available. And a quick little bio of what is going on. Don't forget to look for the Grocery Gang movie online. All right, let's remove from package. Yikes, squished banana is so yellow with a little bit of possible gooey chewy splatted on him. This guy is hard to look at, but still very funny. I'm just glad they left him in the peel for the toy. Articulation on the arms and legs. A little stiff because he's just out of the box. I'm going to have to work on softening those hinges. And a Grocery Gang logo on the back. Banana Club Weapon Accessory looks violent. Tight fit, but a good looking weapon. And of course, a small squished banana grocery. Feels like there's just a little more paint and care put into these smaller groceries that go with the action figures. Cool deal, Ricardo is out and so is the main cast of the Grocery Gang movie. Next up, it's Powered Up Blowfly. Wait, was Blowfly in the movie? I can't remember now. I keep seeing the movie in pieces. Blowfly, aka Buzz. Watch out for the muck from above. Blowfly is one annoying dude. When he's not relaxing on a dog poop, he's nibbling on your lunch. I can't believe I just said that. This mutated maggot with wings has come to help the groceries defeat the clean team. Gross to the max, Blowfly loves to dive bomb the enemy and drop the slop on his opponents. He's one foul fly. Get ready to fight dirty. I have this strange feeling he was cut from the show due to disgustingness. Okay, Blowfly, let's get you out of the pack. And a Blowfly out of the box looking quite messy. A blue and green splatted fly guy with a purple disgusting mouth. I like the teeth that they put on these. The designs of these toys are quite amazing. On the back here, I was surprised we have some wings. Well, of course, it's a fly, but for some reason I didn't anticipate, and they're really kind of neat, kind of transparent. You can see through them, and they are on ball joints of sorts, so you can rotate them around at the most. I don't think you could really pull them out too far, but they rotate. And we also have little clear transparent antenna. So this is a really nice, well done figure. Also with the arm articulation, again, these legs are kind of stiff to work on them a little bit. One and two and three and four. And we have a fly swatter accessory. That's a good accessory match. Pretty solid putrid power action figure. Of course we have a little blow fly here. And again, they've done well with the little minis. They are painted pretty cool. And it looks like you might be able to place a grocery onto that fly swatter somehow. There's a little bit of muck on there so you might be able to get a grocery to stick onto the fly swatter. Always a nice touch with the accessories. I wasn't too into blowfly at first but now it is growing on me. Or at least flying around me. And finally it is powered up fungus fries. 
Now this one was one of the ones I wanted to find initially, so it's good to see. I like that deep fryer accessory weapon. Fungus Fries, aka Chips McGraw. Fungus Fries is proof that you don't need to be crazy to live in the Yucky Mart, but it sure helps. Fungus Fries is packed with grease. This makes him a slippery dude to catch. A little crazy and mostly mad, he's a team member who's always chips in to battle. His motto, winning's easy when you're extra greasy. Get ready to fight dirty. Another good bio. A little bit reminiscent to Frylock from Aqua Team Hunger Force. Let's remove from pack. Fungus fries out. Almost as if Bart Simpson became some sort of food item. Very well done on the spiky fry hair. In fact, look at the layering and whatever you want to call it, the sculpt of these fries. It is so well detailed. It's amazing what these Grocery Gang action figures can do. Grocery Gang logo on the back. And again, great coloring. There is so much paint and plastic switchery on these guys. They're so vibrant and colorful. And we have a mini order of fungus fries here. And this amazing accessory deep fryer grid pan. I think that's my favorite accessory out of everything. You can even put your grocery inside. That is fun and very, very strangely cute. I have to recommend Fungus Fries, one of my favorite, along with Gooey Chewy. Now for a quick deviation, I am trying to collect all of the Pac-Man Mashems. So far we've been lucky with Pinky, and then Blinky. Will we be able to continue the collection, or will repeats begin to play? Let's find out. Oh, awesome! A power pellet affected ghost! That was cool, I kind of forgot that these would be included. And this is the kind that if you got multiples of, you would not be upset. Are you still trying to find all those Pac-Man squishums? What am I doing here? That's so random. I'm not Grocery Gang. Well, I'm very cool with today's find. Continuing along with the Grocery Gang, your shopping's gone rotten. 16 Groceries Trash Can Pack. With two exclusive trash stained groceries in the front window there. On the back of the box, a collection guide for many of your Series 3 things. It would be nice to find some more clean team members. Let's open up. Alright, inside the box we have a tray of some yellow bagged who knows what groceries. And we have four blue trash cans. And then of course we have our exclusives. They're kind of stuck in there. What do we start off with? Let's just dump it all out. I really do dig these reusable boxes. Once these guys are out of the package, just simply refill the box and close up. Pop in the closet, play again tomorrow. Up close with a slimy peel. For surely more trashed stained than usual. How's he compared to, say, squished banana? Much more rotten. And this must be Mucky Duck, a little more green version. Not too bad. Well, let's start opening some of these yellow bags and see who we can find. Looks like we'll start with Nasty Nuts. I like how Nasty Nuts has nuts kind of in his cheek sides as he has eaten nuts. Fun one. I always like the ones where the eyes are going different ways. Something went flying, and I'm excited! Clean team, polish off. You can almost hear the steel ball inside mixing it up. Very cool. Pukey pumpkin pie. Ah, pumpkin pie, a great favorite during Thanksgiving. I think this is my third or fourth pukey pumpkin pie, but I have one in green too. Ugh, what is that? Slob fish. Very disgusting. Looks like something Jabba the Hutt might eat. Little tail on the back. 
Very gross. Ooh, I like this one. Stink Sink. Anything with two very vibrant colors are usually my favorite. So this bright lime green and a bright sky blue mixed together really makes for a popping grocery. I like that one. Stink Sink, remember that. Another Nasty Nuts. Nasty Nuts is common, so you'll find that one quite often. Oh, the jokes abound with Nasty Nuts. Might be a fun one to doodle because it's so square. Um, what is that? It would be hair fryer. Interesting, hair fryer, blow dryer. Kind of got a black mask going on, a little greenness on it. That's kind of uh, kind of scary, a little bit, uh, a little bit scary. Put that guy right there. Oh ho ho! It's a slop bucket. That looks tasty. You slop bucket. Disgusting. Here's another possible new favorite: foul burger. <laughs> so it's a chicken burger gone foul. Um, I love it. Love the name on that. Love the back end on that. Pretty good paint on that too. Disgusting. Oh, seen this guy before several times. A dirty deck. Maybe my third dirty deck. A good one though. Skateboard up on a bunch of slime. Stands really well. Good one. I think all these trash cans are empty. Yeah, you just put stuff in them when you're done. Hey, scabby crab! I like this guy. Very cute, very silly. Look at these eye stalks. They're kind of springy. A little bit of slime coming out of him. Sebastian, what happened to you? I don't know, man. I don't feel good. Blech. Very fun. Could probably use with your Lego Ninjago sets. I think I saw the bad guys shooting some crab. This one could be fancy, if it wasn't rotten. A rotten rim. Very neat. Very clever. This one's thinking way outside of the box. It's like they're running out of ideas. What do we got? How about rotten rim? I like it. Rotten rim's fun to play with because you can kind of roll him around. He's got a little bit of a flat base, but you can still do some rolly with it. This one would be cool to see in metallic. Absolutely. Scabby meal in blue. I believe I have a scabby meal somewhere in red. Little lunchbox like grocery. That is alive. Be careful. Could eat ya. Alright, last one out of this pack. Oh, it's squishy, so it's not clean team. It is a chunky curry though. What is curry? I don't think I've ever had curry before. Is it fish? I love it when they have a little bit of gradient color going on. This one from bright yellow to dark red orange. Another fun grocery. And that is 15 interesting groceries from this trash can pack. And one clean team member. I guess that will do. And there would be the things that we saw today. Three great Wave 2 grocery gang action figures. Squished banana, fungus fries, and blowfly plus 16 groceries from a boxed garbage can. Nothing beats the zaniness of these toys. I beg to differ. Oh, hey, he's vacuuming up all the groceries. There they go. Hey, I like that one. Oh man. Well, thanks for leaving the clean team out. The Grocery Gang action figures from Moose. Wave 2 arrives on store shelf, fall 2017, running approximately $7 per figure. And the 16 groceries trash can box collection, also on the shelf, runs about 15. If you like bright, vibrant, angry, foodie action figures, the Putrid Power Team is for you. If you're looking for something cleaner, you'll have to collect a lot more to find those rare clean team items. That's what I have to say about that. Putrid Power Pellet, knock out the Pac-Man. Thank you for watching Squirrel Stampede.
Please, like, share, subscribe. Let's start off with the famous, powered up, squished banana. Banana. Let's start off with the... Let's start off with the famous, powered up, a squished banana. Powered up, a squished banana, Ricardo.